Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2018 Optic Football Collector's Edition where you can win a TriStar item. This is break number 5. 16 spots. Um, we'll double up your names for the one box break, but for the purposes of the, all the uh, TriStar items right here, for the purposes of that, we're going to uh, different dice roll, randomize your um, the original 16 names in this and then randomize the remaining item numbers and then we'll go from there. So the one, four, five, six, those are the remaining item numbers. But actually, let me just copy this and put them into this extra, this other blank list right here. That's for the randomizer at the end of the break. But for this one, let's double up both Logan and Tyler's names here. We're going to do that quick one box break. All 32 teams are in. Let's roll it and randomize it. Snake Eyes, two and two. Thanks, Ram.org. Nice low number. We want to get to the, the good stuff here, like the TriStar item. Two, Snake Eyes, easy. Bunch of Tylers, down to a bunch of Tylers, and some Logans sprinkled in. Two times, teams, one, two. Chargers, down to Dolphins. All right, the, the voice feeling a little raw. I'm not gonna read off all these, but Logan, Falcons, Steelers, Vikings, Rams, Ravens, Patriots, and then Tyler, you have the rest. All right, let's order these alphabetically. And I'm just going to close the trade window, I'm assuming. These two guys just want to get to who gets the TriStar item. All right, TWC trade window closed. Let's open up this box of 2018 dollars Optic Football Collector's Box Edition with the exclusive bronze autographs in here. Oh, Baker's only down by two now. Ten minutes left in the fourth quarter. I don't think I'd mind if the if the Lakers win by 11 points. Which could still happen. Ooh, LeBron sinking a three. Nice. Lakers take the lead, 94-93. Defense. Defense. So uh, a week ago. Um, there was a half court. I'm sure if you if you are uh, if you're in a city with an NBA team, you know that a lot of these NBA teams do the half like a half court shot, and you get a certain amount of money, right? Lakers half court shot promo that they did recently. Some guy won. Some guy won. Uh, hit a half court shot. Won a hundred thousand dollars. And here in LA. Now, <laughs> there was a there was a Knicks by by comparison, and obviously, you know, you would think that the big market teams will get you uh, will get you uh, big money, right? Well, in New York, <laughs> some Knicks fan hit a half court shot, and he got a thousand dollars of lottery scratchers. Which I thought, I thought, I thought maybe, maybe the garden would be a little more generous there. There's Tyler Conklin, bronze. Sorry, points, lame. Josh Rosen, rated rookie. I think that maybe kills the auto, right? I think there'll just be a relic in here somewhere. Let's breeze through the rest of these. James Washington, relic. Uh, I, he has scratched them, Gabriel. I'm looking at the M NBC Sports article right now saying Knicks fan who hit half-court shot to win $1,000 of scratchers says he netted $500. So I mean, he won $1,500 on scratchers. That's not so bad. Or maybe he only won – I guess it's free. So if he's nets 500 that means he only got 500 because the scratchers were essentially free.
So I guess maybe no taxes on the scratchers though. The Lakers guy, Lakers guy probably probably walked away with like seven hundred or no seventy thousand dollars. Probably twenty thirty percent off on the taxes in California. It's probably a lot. All right, let's see who gets the item. And guess what? The winner of the item, I'll just give them the 250 points, too. I'm not going to do a separate randomizer for the points. All right. Item. Tristar item. Randomize. New dice roll, just like it's break credit. There's that. And there's the four remaining items right here. We've got that one in a box, two in those bubble packs, which could be should be jerseys, and then the there's a black envelope that will be the redemption. Let's roll it and randomize it. Each list. Three times. Good luck. One. One. Come on, random.org. Oh, do you get some money from a YouTuber? No, you can't say that he ended up with 10,000, with 10.5K. That YouTuber money doesn't count. Nick's ownership has more has more has more than more than a thousand dollars to give away in a half court promo. There's one finally. What did I say? Three times one, two, and three. Name on top is Tyler. Just edging out Logan. Tyler after three. Now three times for the remaining items. One, two, three. Item four. Thanks, Logan, for giving it a shot. You almost got him. You almost got Tyler. Item four. Is this right here? We'll play a quick round of Who Am I? Everyone can play. Oh, these are like industrial strength. So. We can play a quick round of Who Am I? Everyone can play. They give you this little card right here too, so I feel like a, like a game show host. All right, so congrats, Tyler. Who am I? I'm a nine-time Pro Bowl selectee. Uh, I was once an AFC often. I can't give away the year right now. AFC often it would make it too easy. AFC Offensive Rookie of the Year, the same year won NFL MVP, Associated Press NFL MVP. When's the last time that happens? A Rookie of the Year, Offensive Rookie of the Year, winning the MVP. Um, AFC Offensive Player of the Year, AFC Offensive Player of the Year. Ten years later, NFL Comeback Player of the Year, a Walter Payton Man of the Year. Holds numerous NFL records. They don't want to list all of these NFL records. I'm a quarterback, by the way. Numerous NFL records. Pro Football Hall of Fame in 2005. We start to giving giving it away here. College Football Hall of Fame in 2002. Played college. This is going to give it away. Played college at Pittsburgh. There you go, Daniel. You got it. Nice one. This is also a Mitchell and Ness jersey, so it's a nice jersey too. It's Dan the Man Marino. I like how there's just too many records. Just holds numerous NFL records is all they can put there. So that is a nice jersey right there. There's Marino splashed across the back. There's the TriStar authentication. There's Dan's autograph. Very nice. And this is worth taking out of the jersey or out of the, the pouch here because it's a Mitchell and Ness jersey. So you even have the original tags here. That's nice. You got this cool tag on the bottom right here as well. Yeah, that is the guy. Of, yeah, I, I don't know who this guy is. This guy, I know him from Ace Ventura, though. Um, there you go. Yeah, lace is out, Dan. Come on. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That was the break. 
Excellent quarterback, of course. Dan Marino, I think I think he he went to the Super Bowl like his rookie year, right? This 1984 offensive rookie rookie of the year and 84 AP NFL MVP went to the Super Bowl. I think that year or maybe the year after, and he famously said, "This is easy. We'll be back here every year." He wasn't that bummed about the loss to the Super. He's just like a, he's like he's like I'll be here I'll be here next year, you know. And yeah, and then never again, which is which is. Which is kind of crazy. That's such a cautionary tale. It's just like, man, appreciate the Super Bowl like if you're in it because you never know. All right, folks. There you go. That was break number five. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.